In Tien in Belgium, where the Cesse van der Hover Sugar Beet Seed Center of Excellence is located, the sugar beet seeds undergo a difficult and high-tech process to ensure farmers all over the world get the best sugar beet quality. The raw seeds are being cleaned, steeped, primed, pelleted, coated, and finally packed to be transported worldwide. Our second factory in Kiev, Ukraine, processes the Cess van der Havre sugar beet seeds for the local market. Now, let's take a more detailed look at the process of what seems to be a simple sugar beet seed. At the Cess van der Havre sites in the seed production areas in the south of France and Italy, the harvested seed is roughly cleaned for the first time. Afterwards, this raw seed is shipped to Tienen. The first step of the process, cleaning, ensures that twigs, stones, dried earth, and non-sugar beet seeds are removed. At the same time, the seeds which are too large, too small, empty, or which have insufficiently developed embryos are being rejected. The cleaning and sorting of the seeds is a very selective process, executed by different high-tech machines, and is based on an enormous experience. These machines are connected with each other through an internal tube system and transporting elevators through which the seeds travel to be polished and to be sorted by caliber and weight. The caliber and weight of the sugar beet seeds are very important issues and those criteria are checked several times throughout the process. After this first step, only 25-30% to 30 of the processed or naked seed is good enough to be pelleted. The next step in the processing chain is the pelleting of the seeds. Naked seed is being covered with a powder mixture of wood flour, clay, and glue to give the seeds their typically round shape. If the seeds wouldn't have a round shape, the farmer would not be able to sow them on the fields with a sowing element. The whole pelleting process lasts for several hours and takes place in big rotating drums. Continuously, water and pelleting powder are being sprayed on the seeds. During the following drying process, the water will evaporate, turning the weak shell around the naked seed into a hard pellet. Thanks to our state-of-the-art SATEC machines, the pelleting process has been shortened by several hours, therefore lifting the seed quality of the Cess van der Havre sugar beet seeds to a higher level and reducing the bottlenecks in the processing chain. An additional quality boost for the seed is the coating layer, especially for its survival capacity after germination. In the coating process, fungicides and insecticides are included in the Cess van der Hoffer blue outer layer of the pellet. Thanks to this treatment, the seeds are offered a very efficient protection of the young seedling. From an environmental point of view, this type of treatment is also better. A lower concentration of pesticides is used in an optimal way the coating process of naked and pelleted seeds takes place in small rotating drums where fungicides and insecticides are being applied on the pellet. The type and concentration depends on the market demand. Every sugar beet seed that is being processed and produced in our Tienen and Kiev factories receives the typical and world-famous blue color of Cess van der Hover. When the cleaning, pelleting and coating process is finalized, the blue seeds are ready to be packed into commercial boxes, the so-called units. A unit contains 100,000 seeds, which are packed in a cardboard box. Every year, Cess van der Hover distributes more than 1 million units of sugar beet seed. That is 100 billion seeds to more than 40 countries worldwide.